have some fun outside and even maybe enjoy a little bit of live music in downtown at Beacon Park. And that's where our one, our only Veronica Meadows is this morning. Veronica, what else do they got going on at Still Loading Music and Art Festival? Yeah, Michael, well, it is already a beautiful morning here in downtown Detroit at Beacon Park. And if you are feeling like getting outside, getting out and checking out some free art and free music, you can definitely come down here to Beacon Park for the Still Loading Festival. Mike Delore is here to tell us all about how House of Dank is involved in this initiative. You have to be so excited to be one of the sponsors here. Oh my gosh, absolutely. I mean, uh, you know, coming out of COVID with the pandemic and this being one of the first really great live events in the city of Detroit, the fact that we House of Dank are able to kind of give back to the city and be a part of this is absolutely amazing. Uh, the moment that Melissa had reached out to us and told us about the program, we were 100% involved and, and it's, we're really proud to be one of the title sponsors here today. We hope everybody comes on out. It's going to be a great day. It's still a little surreal for me personally that things are getting back to normal and that we can start going back to festivals and kind of being together again. It just it has to be super exciting for you guys. Oh, no question about it. I mean, you know, we, we've all been living through this for the past year. So being able to come on out and actually talk to people, dance a little bit. We're going to dance today. All right. And that is amazing. Okay. You know how long it's been since I've danced with other people watching. It's been too long. So I'm really looking forward to that. And I hope that other people can come out and watch me dance as well. But that's really what it's all about for us. Having some fun, getting the message out there about the festival, about House of Dank, and really just inviting people out to be human again, because that, that's what this is all about. Like, you know, a beautiful day, beautiful art, great music. Music. like that itself is is the human condition okay like we've been doing this for thousands of years so let's keep it rolling and you know I think too if people are maybe kind of wanting to take baby steps to going back to festivals and kind of getting back to normal maybe this would be a good option for them because you can still wear a mask if you feel comfortable you can socially distance lots of options for people here absolutely absolutely and it's a beautiful park if you haven't been down here before DTE and the city have done a fantastic job um, but it is absolutely beautiful and quite spacious you can come out you can socially distance or you can not socially distance. The choice is really all yours, you know, but we are going to have great food, art, and music. So it's a, it's a perfect combination on a beautiful day. Absolutely. More information about the festival is on your screen as we speak. All of the fun starts at 11 a.m. this morning and goes until 11 p.m. and then tomorrow. So plenty of time for people to come check everything out. Absolutely. There is no shortage of time to come out and get your dance on. At 11 a.m., we're having one of our HOD employees is going to open the festival and she's going to be doing a set. So come on down in the morning and uh, listen to some chill music at 11 today. Awesome. So chill music starting at 11. Yep. Super exciting. And you're going to be able to check out a lot of different artists as well. Lots of different kinds of artists are going to be here too. Which one are you look, most looking forward to? What, you know, there are a number of different artists, but there are some people that have come in from South America that are doing some really amaz uh, amazing light installations. I think that that's what I'm most looking forward to. You know, when the sun sets a little bit later today, or the lights go down in the tent and, and the lights start popping, there's a huge LED setup. It's going to be absolutely amazing. But I think that's the thing that I'm looking forward to the most is checking out the LED light setup. So it sounds like you're going to be here literally all day. All day long. Come on out and visit us all day, baby. Mike is super excited for the festival. If you all can't tell back at home, he cannot wait for everything to get started here. So if you want to come dance with Mike in person and if you want to come check everything out, it's still loading. Again, everything starts at 11 this morning. It is free. There will be lots of artists, live music, definitely a lot of installations for you to all come check out. This morning, we're at Beacon Park, Veronica Meadows. We'll send it back to you.